Yes, we have actually very successful cooperation with our fellow counterparts in FAO. Between Eurasian Economic Union and FAO, we have signed a memorandum of understanding with an action plan, which is we are planning to update this year. So far, we've done a lot of work, especially targeted on sustainable agriculture development. We have done an excellent work together by publishing a report on uh, development of the plant production in the member states of the Eurasian Economic Union, which included also lots of measures targeted on increasing efficiency, optimizing costs, and stuff like that. With colleagues at FAO, we've been discussing also a lot on the agenda on the digitalization of agriculture. You know that this topic has become very popular, especially when different sectors of economy started to include digitalization and technologies in the agriculture. So we've done a lot, but we're also looking forward to include in the new action plan, new direction. And one of the directions that I've mentioned obviously will be targeted on more digitalization and technologies in the agriculture, keeping in mind that whatever we do, we also have to put a lot of emphasis on sustainability of agriculture. You know, the challenge is that different member states of the Eurasian Economic Union actually have a different structure of the agriculture. In some of the cases, it could be a very large production facilities. In other parts, it could be subsistence farmers. So the solutions are very much different. So what we're trying to do, we're trying to bring together the expertise of FAO, the private sector engagement, especially the industrial agriculture, and by means of mobilizing knowledge and resources, we're targeting them towards development of sustainable small agriculture as well. Another important challenge that we see at the moment, I would say, is the climate change. And so we, at the Commission, and together with the partners at FAO, we're trying to target also policies on the sustainable agriculture development. And so those are the few areas that we're working together, and I think those directions will be included in the new agenda. As you mentioned, how to find the best solution to the challenges that we're facing. You know, the regional conference is at first is a good platform to meet people, to meet colleagues. Right in the morning, we had a very interesting discussion with the director for the digital at FAO, for example, and we thought about directions that we can include in our future work as well. Of course, we're working through our regional office as our main counterparts, and it's important to channel this information to the HQ to bring in the best expertise. So the first, I would say, it's a platform to meet people, to meet new, uh, I would say, specialists and experts in new directions that are important for us. And of course, the agenda. A lot of interesting stuff happening in the world, and I think it's a good chance to bring that new directions into our action plan as well. <laughs>